What is up, my amazing family? Welcome back to another Forza Horizon 3 video. Today we're back for another realistic driving episode, and I've just bought a really cheap car for this uh, and put the suspension on it, which in all cost me about... I want to say 2800 bucks, so it's, I mean, 28000 bucks actually, so, you know, this actually wasn't a very uh, high-priced car in the game, so, uh, this is a 1970 Datsun, I believe it's called, uh, if you don't pronounce it that way, I'm sorry, but, um, yeah, this is what the car looks like, this is the interior of the car, and, uh, yeah, let's just get going, so, uh, same rules apply for last time. Uh, normal roads, speed limit 70, and the, um, the highway, it's 90. Wait, wait a minute, I just want to check, does this car, okay, this car does have rear view mirrors. I didn't see it down there in that little corner. So, yeah. Now, this thing doesn't go fast, it has, it actually has, a, like, a speed of 3.8. So, it's not, it's not a bad car, you know, it's just, it just needs some tuning I guess you could say so actually let's head out on the highway and we're gonna go that way towards the city I guess so I'm gonna turn around over here yeah this is floored right now so it's not a very fast car but it does okay I guess uh, that I don't know what, what that really was I want to say Range Rover but that doesn't really make sense uh, I, I, I thought it was going to kill me. So yeah, this, this, this is kind of a good car though. And I may have gone over the uh, speed limit there, I just didn't notice. I can turn up game sound a little bit for you guys. Oh boy. There we go, it's up to 13. You'll have to tell me if that's better. Alright, so we're just going to use the highway here. And go towards, um... Byron Bay. Or Byron Bay. I forget what it's called. See, this thing, it's not terrible when it comes to acceleration. And, uh... Keeping its speed. It's actually not bad. It, it's a fairly good car. Uh, I want to see if we just did any damage by hitting that thing. Nope. We're good. I always got to be checking to see if there's anything behind me so that I can turn. Oh gosh. I got to use that mirror over there, but I can't because it's so far... Uh, it's so far down. I just love the thing where the speedometer actually tells how fast we're going in game. That's something really cool I like about this game. When you go first person in cars, it shows the speedometer and it shows how fast you're going. And you know what? This is not legal driving right now. I'm not doing a very good job of legal driving. And this guy needs to speed up a little bit. <laughs> We're going 70. About, to, about time to shift into fourth. There we go, fourth gear. Whoa! That was a big brake check, don't you think, buddy? Jeez. Looks like we're coming up on the city here. Let me check. Uh, kind of. The roundabout, I would consider. This is the suburb area over here, so we'll drive through the suburb area maybe a little bit and then go down to the downtown area if we have time. Uh, but I do have another 
<clears throat> I do have another car planned for today. It's an old Dodge van. Uh, it's not very fast at all, but, you know, it does good for the realism of this series type thing. So look out for that later today. And I'm just going to be getting over real quick because I don't see anybody. Okay, yeah, he was over there. And you don't sideswipe me, buddy. That's a good way of looking at that. Just looking out like that and that, that and that, you know. Oh, he got over. Ooh, boy, bro. Slam it. Uh, is there anybody over here? Nope. We're good. I have a question for you people in the comments. Since this is Australia in the game, would the right lane be considered the fast lane now? Because usually it's the left lane. Now, I do, I'm just curious about that. Does it mean the, the, the right lane is the fast lane there and the left lane is the fast lane here? That, I've just kind of wondered that for the past few days. So, if you guys could answer that for me, I would be glad to hear it, and thank you very much. So, okay, we're coming up on the roundabout, which means we really need to slow down, and I was not being very cautious about that. Isn't it a little dangerous to go around a roundabout at, like, 40? Uh, let's see. Do I want to turn here? Uh... No, I want to go to the next exit. And he just hit that sign. You need to drive legally, my friend. So now that we're... Actually, uh, I never did make this clear. In town roads, we have to drive... We have to drive 50 or less. That was one of my rules. So it goes 50, 70, 90. I'm watching that mini in my mirror. <laughs> I love this car though. I don't know why. It was just a little bit of a cheap thing to buy. Ooh. Excuse me for a second, guys. Okay, there we go. And it's still on my hood. I apologize. <laughs> <clears throat> All right, second gear. I have a feeling we're about to shift up to third or not. Go around this corner at about 35. Oh, I saw that shadow in my car and I got scared. I <laughs> oh, man. Nice suburbs. It's all good. Alright, that guy looks like he has the same car as me. I'm curious. I don't want to wreck- Ah! Does he have the same car as me? No, he actually doesn't. He has a completely different car than me. But I just want to see how much damage did that do. Uh, bumper got a little bent. You know, other than that, nothing really major. And I can't really complain. Uh, I want to see where the, like, of the, <laughs> I want, no, I want to see what the best way to get to the city is. Uh, just go straight and then take a right at the beach. I guess let's do that. We. <laughs> I don't think this is just a spawning vehicle as the AI. 
Uh, I wish it was though, because it would look really good roaming around. This really is a nice car. I mean, you guys may not think so, because it's kind of slow and it's old. But, you know. This car's good. It's a nice little car. And I might race in it to see how it does. It doesn't hurt getting second or third place in a race. You know, just to test out a vehicle. I don't think this was legal, but you know what? We did it because we thought it was. Um, <laughs> that's all that matters, really. Actually, not really. That 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 that. I can't even talk. So I wanted to take a left here or a right here, right? Yeah, I wanted to take a right. All right, so I guess we gotta come up here. Whoa, what are you, what are you doing? Oh my gosh, she just like, he just sideswiped me. Or maybe he didn't, but did he do anything to my car? Yo, that, that, he, that guy was an idiot, man. He just came up out of nowhere and just like almost hit me. These people need to chill out. Uh, but we really gotta look both ways though, see if there's anything coming. Okay, so after that blue car up there, we can go and then... Uh, BMW, everything is clear. Actually, after that trans van, we'll go after that. Okay, let's go. There's my clock, I'm sorry. <laughs> Just had to get over, didn't you, buddy? This is not a one-way road. And this thing is actually pretty loud, you know? It sounds good. Listen to this. It's actually a really nice car. Oh, man, it's raining. What are you doing? Jeez, these people. Never mind, Byron Bay is like all the way down there. Oops. Well, I guess maybe we'll start uh, in Byron Bay next video for the uh, realistic driving. But I'm going to sign off here, guys. Let me pull over here. So I hope you guys did enjoy the video, and if you have, please tell me down in the comments what you did really think of the video. Also, subscribe to my channel, hit the little bell next to the uh, subscribe button for notifications, and hit the like button if you enjoyed the video. I'll talk to you guys in the next realistic driving video for Forza Horizon 3. Peace out.